Hello all, welcome back to Excel Skill. Today we will learn how to use the serial number to any given data set inclusive of blank rows. Here I have the product and item code and as well as quantity. With this data I also have the blank row in between the data. So now I want to add the serial number only where the data is populated and it should not include the or it should not count the blank rows. To this I will use the A formula along with the count A formula. We will get the serial number where it has the blank rows and it doesn't count the blank rows for this given data. Give equals then give if open the parenthesis if b3 is nil give equal sign Open the inverted comma, then again close inverted comma, give comma, then again if the value is false, it should be blank. For blank, again use the inverted comma, then again give comma. Now count if count a. Here I am using both a formula and as well as the count a function together to get the serial number automatically. If any data in under b column, if you enter any data, automatically the serial number will appear. If it is blank, it doesn't consider the serial number. Only if there is any value only then the serial number would be appearing. Again open the parenthesis. Choose the B3. Then freeze the B3. Shift F4. Then Enter the colon, enter again B3, close the parenthesis and again the close the parenthesis because we are using two functions that is if and count A function together. It enter, you will see the number. The same number will appear to the next value. Okay, here 1, 2, 3, 4. If I have to enter anything under the white panes, just to check, it is taking the number. So if I have to delete, the number pattern will also change. A, B, C, enter, the number changes and if I have to take out that A, B, C and it enter, the number is changing accordingly. I hope this trick will help in your day-to-day -day operations and I will come up with the more excel tips and tricks. Do share, like and comment and do subscribe to my channel. Subscription is free. Please do subscribe for excel tips and tricks. Thank you for watching this video. I will come up with another video with, with tricks and tips. Thank you again. See you.